Hello Sagittarius, this is Cupid's advice for you for the month of May 2016. You've got three major arcana this month, so it will be quite significant month for you and important. So uh, the potential of the month uh, in love life you've got the temperance. Temperance is balance, peace, uh, when we feel comfortable, when there is harmony between us and our partner, um, compromises also, healing. So you have a great potential of healing your love life and feel they're more comfortable. So you can heal it until that condition, so you will feel they're comfortable. What can help you? Justice. Justice, it's fairness, honest talks, uh, equality with your partner, and if you're single, with the people, honesty, equality, uh, so don't be a snob, <laughs> don't uh, under-evaluate yourself as well, like see things how they are, see facts, reality, and uh, speak your own truth without uh, some extra emotions, uh, without getting uh, um, excited or upset. Because justice is like how they're talking in the court of law. They're just saying the facts. Calm, quiet, and la 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 la, it's like this. He went out of the room at six o'clock and then he turned to the left. La la la. So the same is justice. Try to stay calm. Be fair, be honest, and uh, bring more equality in communication. What can be a problem for you? There is Empress reversed. I'll show you upright because probably it's difficult to see. It's a wolf. Empress. Empress, when she's upright, she can see bigger picture. She, it's fertility, abundance, beauty. She is very fruitful, creative when it's when she is reversed. Oh, she can get lazy. She can't see this big picture. She can see only some small things. Uh, it can uh, be a problem. Uh, this energy, and also it's. I would say this empress reversed. It's sound like a we female tricks of what kind when uh, you know if we're talking about uh, these tricks it's something like when woman are uh, speaking to a man and she is trying to temptate him but she is not doing it obviously obviously she is doing doing it in some hidden way but she understands what she's doing but then, when he is falling in love with her, she's like staying there, looking with honest eyes and saying, "Me? I didn't man. I didn't mean it. Uh, it wasn't me who tried to um, take him in the relationship." So I'm talking about tricks like that. So laziness, can't see a bigger picture. Maybe dishonesty as well, because Empress, it's a beautiful card. It's a Venus in uh, uh, this good side of uh, Venus, but in reverse, it's a bad side of Venus. Maybe also jealousy, any kind of uh, what uh, bad can be in the relationship. Maybe codependency, you know, because this justice, it's equality. So if you have some difficult relationships where you are like you can't have your voice, you can't speak your truth, you also have to adjust it, you have to understand it, you must adjust it. So on the bottom of the deck there is, I'll show it upright because it came upside down, Ten of Wands, astrological sign of this card, Saturn in Leo, no, Saturn in Sagittarius, Saturn in your sign. And now Saturn is going in your sign, it's moving. But in reverse, it's like feeling so 
tired, feeling so a little bit even depressed. Like I have to work hard all the time, all the time, and I don't want it. But Lenormand cards for this ten of um, ones in reverse, they showed cross. It's like you have to. There are some things we can't avoid. We can't tell this Saturn to move <laughs> in another sign. Because each sign, we have all signs having these uh, difficulties. Uh, me, I'm Aquarius now, it's in another house, in one particular house, and I'm having difficulties there. And I have to work with them, them and uh, people bringing me more and more difficulties. But I have to work with it, I have to like take care of things I don't want to take care of, but I have to. Otherwise, if I'll try to like like a bad student run away, then I might get more problems. So be disciplined. Understand that some difficulties, they are temporary. You have to be just a um, diligent pupil and then things will be all right. So, dear Sages, I'm wishing you love, abundance, to find this balance, to be happy, enjoy life, and see you soon.